Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Today's video or thing, this is the beginning of my Christmas vlog. And I just got done doing my makeup. It's actually Christmas Eve and we are having family coming over today. So I just finished my makeup and I'm just trying to hold the camera with like my hand and so it's kind of like really terrible. But I just, I love my makeup. It's like, I did purple and I followed a tutorial from Nikki Tutorials. So if you're wondering how to get this look, just you can go over there. It's the purple holiday glam one, although I didn't have anything that she had. So I used mostly my Too Faced Vegas Nay palette to do the eyes, um, except for some of the glitter is a ColourPop shadow in tinsel, but the rest I used that palette. And then for the lips, I am wearing a e.l.f. matte lip color in the shade T Rose. It's really pretty. So. I'm currently sitting on the floor. Say hi, Theo. Say Merry Christmas. I need to go eat lunch because, you know, I'm pregnant and when you're pregnant, you can't, like, it's the weirdest thing since I've been pregnant. When I get hungry, it like hits all of a sudden and it's like demanding, like, I have to eat or, or my body is like freaks out. So I'm gonna go eat some leftovers, either some pizza or some Mexican. I don't know which one, but I'm going to show you what I'm making for tonight's dinner. It's super exciting, so. So this is what I'm making for our dinner tonight. We're having family over at our house. Usually, for the two years that Ryan and I have been married, we go to his family's house. Excuse me. <clears throat> we go to his family's house on Christmas Eve, and they usually have French dips, beef dip uh, sandwiches. So this year, Ryan wanted to have it our, at our house since we have a new house. And he wanted me to make this ham I made one time <laughs> when we were first married. It is a brown sugar and pineapple ham. And this ham was so big it barely fit in this freaking crock pot. I have to like smush the lid down. But it smells so good in here right now and I'm so excited to eat this. So we're having that and I'm going to make some mashed potatoes later. And it's going to be delicious. I decided to have pizza instead of Mexican because I don't want to have an upset stomach. I'm having Little Caesars, this is leftovers. Fun fact, I used to work at Little Caesars. It was the very first job I ever had. I worked there for three years in high school. It was super fun. I loved working there. My brother still works there. He's a year younger than me, but he is a manager there now. But he is, I think, about to leave. So, we'll see. But it's in the microwave and it's cooking. While well, my pizza is cooling down, I'll go ahead and show you our Christmas tree. This is our Christmas tree and our two stockings. We don't have any mantle or anything to like hang the stockings on, which makes me sad. But I love our tree. This is a new tree for us this year. It came pre-lit with these multicolored lights, like the green and stuff. And then I put on gold and these white lights. And um, we just did silver and gold this year. Uh, it's kind of empty in some spots you can tell because Ryan wouldn't let me buy a lot of decorations. So we have the ones we bought this year and then next year I'll get some more so I could fill in the spaces. But And I'll have more lights on it. I think it needs more lights. So and these are all the presents down here. I did. I got all this wrapping paper from Target. It's super pretty. Excuse me Theo. And they're leopard print and then they're all gold and silver. Hey, he is like a camera hog, excuse me. <clears throat> and I really like it. That present over there is for me and Ryan had his mom wrap it. That's why it's different. And there's Theo's gift. He can see it and he really wants it, but he can't have it because it's not Christmas yet. We have to wait. We have to wait. So I'm about to put in this, one of these things. This is something I bought from Walmart like three or four years ago. And it's the original Christmas classics and it's got two DVDs in it. And let's see, this one, this is what they have. This one has Rudolph and Frosty as well as Frosty Returns and Cricket on the hearth. And this one has Santa Claus is Coming to Town, Little Drummer Boy, and Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. And I like to watch these. Ryan doesn't like to watch them, so I have to watch them alone. He's home right now, but he 
threw up this morning and so he's been sick unfortunately for him so um we're gonna i'm gonna watch those and this is our favorite christmas movie we like to watch together don't laugh at us we like this because it has chris brown in it he's right there a young chris brown we uh love chris brown so much i'm sure you guys know that from my monthly favorites if there's a new chris brown song it's probably in my monthly favorites but we love this movie and we watch it every Christmas Eve or that's what we were gonna start doing. We just got it last year, um, but we did watch it the year before that. But we'll probably watch that tonight after everyone leaves. I know a lot of people like to watch Elf, but, and we have that, but you know, it's not my most favorite Christmas movie. So yeah, I'm gonna put that in. So I wanted to show you guys this present before I wrap it up. It's the last one we have to wrap up. So this is for my dad and we got 12 of these hot sauce bottles for my husband's work. And I made these stickers. Um, they're <laughs> like labels for my dad. I told you guys this lots of times. But my dad makes his own hot sauce and he doesn't sell it or anything but he just makes it for family. But I thought it would be funny to get in these bottles because he's always looking for more bottles to put his hot sauce in. And so we got him these bottles and I made this little logo and then I photoshopped his face onto the Tapatio guy and made this, the rest of it just up myself and I called it Miguelito's Mean Muchacho Hot Sauce. My dad's name is Michael so Michael in Spanish is Miguel and so um, I thought it was pretty funny. Um, I hope my dad likes it. I'll have to, I'll film his reaction when he opens this tomorrow so you guys can see, but I just wanted to show you guys that because I'm really proud of it. Ryan's over there chopping potatoes for our mashed potato meal. I already showed you guys the ham. By the way, I showed it to you earlier, but now it's like close to being done and it smells amazing. Are you excited for ham? Mm. I told them that you were throwing up earlier because you're having sympathy pregnancy. Or a stomach virus. Okay, Theo, say goodbye for now. So now we're done with our uh, Christmas Eve thing. Ryan has to turn to the bottle. He said he's getting wasted. Um, so I'll just show you what we got from his side of the family. This is, was a gift to both of us, but really it's a joke because, um, well, it's like Ryan always wears wrinkly pants at church and his mom doesn't like it, so she got him or us this because uh, I'll use it too. this fabric steamer I'm sure you guys know what it is it's pretty awesome and then over here we have all the stuff we got um, I got a Maurice's gift card for maternity clothes uh, which I will need here in about a month or two so that will be good and then oh these are cute I actually really wanted these these are Kate Spade earrings they're just like little bows Super cute. Then Ryan got a bunch of clothes. These are a bunch of sweaters. Um, and then I also got this Kate Spade purse. I'll put it right here so you can see it. Ooh, I've been wanting a Kate Spade purse for a while and my mother-in-law finally got me one. It's real cute, it's just like a cream color. Here, let me turn the ISO up so you can actually see better. It's like a cream color and the inside is pink and it's super cute. I'm excited to have it, I'll have to put that back. And then Ryan got more clothes. He literally got just like a ton of clothes. Um, and boxers and stuff. And here there is a Sephora gift card from my brother-in-law, which you guys know I will be definitely using that. Um, and then here's some Yankee candles, which are like winter scented. This one is frosted fur. This one is frosted treat, which is awesome because I actually don't even have any like winter or Christmassy candles, so that's awesome. And in here are just two salt and pepper shakers, uh, like electric ones, which I've really been wanting those. I'm in love with pepper, so it'll be nice to have one where I don't have to grind it myself. And Theo got nothing. It was a dick the whole night. Makeup is not as pretty as it was earlier today because I've been like slaving over the dinner. We just cleaned up, it's all in there. Had some freaking awesome pie. Yeah, that's about it. I don't know. I told you guys earlier that we were probably going to watch this Christmas after everyone left. I don't know if we're going to do that or not because I'm pretty tired. Are you tired? Anyways, I'll pick up tomorrow uh, when we go to my parents' house. Actually, wait. Tomorrow morning when we open gifts from each other is probably the next time I'll film. So, Alright, peace out. So it's Christmas morning. We just opened all of our gifts. 
Theo got his little thing and he loves his toys. He's been squeaking on them over there. You can see they're thrown all over the floor. Let's see, we'll squeak this one. Um, Ryan got me a bread maker because he wants me to make him bread. <laughs> also, bread is good though. Um, let's see, he also got me these two Disney movies to stock up on our Disney collection. He said he had to order this one from England because a lot of the stores here were out of stock, which is crazy. Um, I got this R2-D2 keychain. These Toms, I'll show you. He gets, he got me Toms, well we've only been married for two years, but like the first year we were, what was it the first year we were married? He got me Toms and I wore them to death. They have holes in the toes now. Um, so it was time that I got a new pair. And these are the ones he got. The last ones he got me were like, they were brown and they had leopard snow print. These ones are gray and have this like checkered thing to them. And they're red on the inside, which I think is cool. Um, I got this mug, because we like both kind of collect mugs. We have a big mug collection. Um, this one's from Snow White, and I like the handle. It's cool. Um, oh, yeah, and he got me this robe. And let's see, I got him some socks right there. You can see the polka dots on. <coughs> some, these are, those are jazz warm-up joggers. So... Utah Jazz, the football, football team, <laughs> uh, basketball team. Will you move the pants for a second so I can show them the books? And then I got them these two baby books. This is the baby owner, owner's manual, and the one below it is the new dad's survival guide. It's like a book written by a dad giving advice to new dads. So I read a couple of pages on the inside before I bought it. And it seems like something that he would like. And then I got this Darth Vader mug for his mug of the year and then I got him something he needs which he's opening right now and it's a otter box show him the otter give me the otter box that you had on there this is what he had on there and the rubber on it was I fell off he chewed it off because he's some kind of freaking beaver I guess I don't know and uh, it was really dirty and just this is look at look at like the dirt in the ew it's so gross so he definitely needed a new one, so I got him a new one. And that's all this candy I got for a stocking. Ryan didn't get me a stocking because he hates me, so I was putting on his new otter box. And let's see, this o'clock at nine, we're supposed to be at my mom's house to eat. So, which I'm starving, so I will talk to you guys when I get there. Bye. This is my mom, she is making breakfast. Um, <laughs> What are you, let's see, those are eggs. We make, I said this in my vlog last year, but we have a, uh, like, egg, ooh, uh, like egg McMuffin things, like from McDonald's you would get, we just make them with, well that's her stuff. The regular ones are over here. Yeah, those biggest for you guys in the feed. Bacon. So. Yeah. We just came to one of his friends. Let's go in here and you can see their Christmas tree. They have their little portable fireplace, which is cool. I want one of these. This is the presents we brought for them. Um, but here's all the gifts. There's a bunch of people that live here, so that's why there's so many gifts. I promise. Um, it was your dad and I. So this is um, Christmas here. We distributed all the presents out. Uh, and then my brother, my youngest brother, Caleb is in Utah, and so we're going to Skype him on Facebook, or Facebook him, so he can be with us and open presents with us. So. Look at Smooch sitting up there. So nice. Well, those are Smooch's presents. He got two presents. They're all quite obviously treats. I did, I'm videoing. This is a vlog. Okay. So my dad is opening this gift from us that, that I showed you guys smell yesterday. Smell just as good too. Smell just as good? Yeah. Look at him. Being all smell like, with the actually, I, I put Those are like the cheapest bows ever too. Kind of I'm doing that for you next year. This for you move one day. <laughs> <laughs> it's a moving box. Danielle. Alright, you have to take, take one out. <laughs> oh! Check it out. There's 12 of them. They don't have stoppers in them, but we'll get them. Hey, Hello, what's that? Hot sauce maker. Hello, we got to get them to serve people at work, oh, and now everybody's Mexican girl. Yeah, look at it. Look at it close. Salsa with it. 
It says yeah, with that, dad's hot sauce. Miguelito's with Reaper, mean yeah. muchacho. Show, bring one over so they can see the. Oh, I thought that you could use that to put on top of the lid to. Oh yeah, I got you. To give me one so Tyler can see. So he can make his own hot sauce like he does. Yeah, they liked him so much she wanted to buy. I made a label for it. Let me see. She just see, branded him. They all have different ones. No, they're all the same. You put them on there. Yeah, oh, I made them. I made it. I got those bottles and stuff from my work. Really? Yeah, so if you ever decide you want more, they're pretty That's cheap. the Tapatio <laughs> guy. So we're home and I thought I would show you what I got from my side of the family. This right here, I'll start with this. This is a bird feeder for our house that my brother got me. Um, this, this is a book that my parents got me for our baby. It's called Wherever You Are, My Love Will Find You. And it came with this little panda bear because the book is about panda bears and so came with that cute little panda bear um, that goes to the bird feeder. Ryan got some shirts. I got this jazz, Utah jazz um, scarf. I got some rags. Down there is a Turkish cotton towel robe. This is some socks that Ryan got. Um, over here, uh, some more Ryan stuff. My grandma got me some clothes, stretchy clothes for when I get fat. <laughs> Um, pregnant. My brother, my one of my other brothers, got us this. Um, it's a pack of three movies, and they all are about babies. Baby's Day Out, Little Rascals, and Tennis the Menace. That's cute. Um, this is also from one of my brothers. It's a Utah Jazz calendar. So we we love our Utah Jazz here, and he lives in Utah, so he has access to all these Utah Jazz stuff, which is why. He got this, which is basically the greatest present that Ryan has ever received. It was to both of us, though, to be fair. Um, this is a, just a basketball that is signed by four jazz players. Uh, Derek Favors, Jeff Withy, Trey Burke, and Trevor Booker. So, that is really awesome. Ryan's favorite gift of all time, right? Anyways, and then this is something that I got from my parents. It's a KitchenAid, and I have wanted a KitchenAid for, like, ever. Since before I was married, I wanted my own, so. And this is one with a nice glass bowl, so that's awesome. I'm so excited for that. Uh, I think that's all that we got from my parents. And my, my parents gave me a stocking, thank goodness, since Ryan failed in that field this year. Um, and those are Theo's gifts that he got this morning. Where is little boy? Oh, he's over here trying to get food. Look at him, just like looking. He's, it's too dark to see. Oh, I forgot this. This is like one of my favorite things we got. I brought it out over here because I wanted to look at it. But this is also from my parents. This is a collection of Disney bedtime stories. So it's like, I'll show you the, the contents. There's like a little note in there. This is from Grandma and Grandpa for our baby. Oh. Sorry, the table of contents sh shows you like all the different, like, you know, characters that some of the stories are based off of. It's got all my favorite ones in there. Um, oh, my bad. Um, I read through one story um, because my sister was like, "These are not bedtime stories." I read through one story. It took me 20 minutes. I don't know what her deal was. I don't know which story she read, but the one I read took me like five minutes maybe but it was really cute and they got these pictures and it's for like I would say this is for a little bit of an older kid don't you think obviously because there's a lot of words on the pages and but it's super cute like this it's this it's pretty thick um, so I'm really excited about that so I think that our Christmas was really fun um, I might vlog a little bit later today I don't know what we're gonna do I don't know we probably don't have anything planned. Maybe I can get somebody to come up here and play games with me because Ryan would rather eat than play games. Guess what I found him doing last night? I woke up at 2 a.m. I came in here because I, I woke up because I heard the microwave. That's what actually what woke me up. So I came out here and he's eating breadsticks at 2 in the morning. And he has no shame, clearly. <laughs> So he didn't eat at my mom's house, and now he's eating my leftovers. Because he says that I make the best mashed potatoes ever from scratch, right? No. Nope. Uh, well, then who does? My mom makes No! No! Listen to him, you guys. Tell him to cleave to his wife. Rude. 
Oh yeah, look at that Darth Vader mug. I got him, show him. He said it's the most realistic looking mug. Have I ever showed you guys our mug collection? I feel like I have. Maybe one day I'll do a whole video on it and maybe Ryan will do it with me. He could talk about his favorite mugs. All right, by the way, just before I sign off here, these Sweet Tart Mini Chewies are like the best candies ever. They're just sometimes really hard to chew if you let them sit in a cold place too long, so don't do that, but. I might see you later. If not, then thank you for watching this vlog. Bye.